Today, we're going to bring in a new headset. Now, I was very impressed with this headset, to be honest with you. When it said 7.1, I was like a little curious because I do own the 7.1 headsets. I own the Astro A50s and comparing with this one, you know what? I was very impressed with this. So we're going to take a look at it and see what you get when you get something like this. All right. So let's open it up and see what you get. All right. So let's go ahead and start what you get here. You get the instructions, first of all, right? The very important instructions, how to set it up, how to use it different ways. All right. We're going to take a look at a couple of things. Now, this is compatible with P PlayStation 5, Switch, PC, any gaming console. It's really, really good with these systems. So especially PS5, we actually been testing it on PlayStation 5. We've been streaming and I've been listening to the other end because I not only own one, but my friend also owns one on the other end. So we're going to take a look at it and see what you get first. You get the microphone here. Yes, it's detachable microphone. And like I said, you could replace this maybe down the line, but this is flexible. It has a because a gooseneck that you could reflect. Um, voice oh, noise cancellation. We're going to go into a little a little testing with that because um, I had issues with this where I could hear a couple of things, but there's a great feature that has uh, included with it. It does have voice cancellation, but it, it it lingers for a couple seconds and you can still hear some background. So and we're going to take a look at that stuff. They give you um, an audio to audio. It's a 3.5 connection. All right. Um, just in case you ran out of batteries or you want to listen to music or anything else, you could connect this to it directly to your phone or any other items. You can do that too. Now they give, give you a charging cord, which is a, a micro USB connection to type A. All right. So the system can can also charge on the docking station. Yes, let's take a look at the docking station. This is a docking station and it has three prongs in the top and then which matches actually the headset on the bottom. So they cradle in here and they could charge through there or you could just manually connect it right underneath of it to charge. And you'll see a little battery indication right there telling you that it's charging too. Now, let's take a look at the actual crater um, and, the, and, the, and the system that you actually could hang your headsets, which is great because um, only one of these gives you a lot more options. Now you have a couple indications here. You got your power on and then battery, how much is charging or it needs any extra charge. Now let's take a look at the actual main system in the back. And this is one of the things that I found very, very awesome on it. If you guys can see it, there's an optical and then there's a USB. So that means if you want to use the optical for the audio and listening to good high quality music at 7.1, Adobe Surround Sound, you can do all that stuff through the optical. Very simple and clever to do. So you could set this up on your TV and listen to all your stations, all your fam, your favorite channels and all that stuff using the headset. So yes, that's correct. Now they do have an audio jack, an auxiliary audio. It's a 3.5 and then they have an off and on button here, of course. All right. Now these features are awesome just on, on by themselves, to be honest, because a lot of these headsets don't include any of this. And this is a really good plus thing to do. All right. All right. Let's take a look at the headsets itself. Now, these are the most comfortable headsets I've used. And to be honest with you, playing for a long time, maybe three or four hours in a sitting down in the gaming system, these are necessary. These are actually like pleather, but they're memory foam. Or I'm not quite sure what kind of material, but very soft, like silk. They feel like silk pretty much. Um, and, and not only did they give you on the headset itself, but they give you actually on the top of it, you can see. So when it rests on your head, you feel like pillows on your head too. So very, very clever of them to set this up all around the whole system. And of course, these are flexible. If you guys notice, they open up and wide. So either angle and of course, they actually open up here more for if you have larger heads, all right? <laughs> so very simple, easy to use. And on top of that, if you guys notice, there's an L there and there's an R there. So you know which one's left and right. Now, on the actual headset, you have a lot of great options. We're gonna take a look at the options you have. You have the speaker controller where you could hear the actual sound, you could lower it down, or you could actually hit it even plus to make it louder. And it's right here, and it's a knob. There's no buttons, it's just a knob going up and down. That's pretty much it. Now, great options you have here. You can connect your microphone, your headsets, and then you can also charge it from here. And then there's the power button that you're gonna to require to turn it on, of course. Uh, it does light up when you turn it on, it lights up. 
Um, there is a, 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 a button here, which is invisible. And it's this is the only thing I didn't like up the microphone because I kept muting myself without even knowing. So when you mute it, 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 it goes into a mute mode. You don't, it doesn't give you any, any noise or any effect. You pretty much have to click on it again. And there is no buttons on this one. It's just on, it's only on the left hand side. If you can see it. it's a button, very sensitive. Uh, that's the only thing I would probably change overall. But to be honest with you, they're one of the best headsets I've used, uh, because of the pricing and because of the way they have many options with the optical, optical and the regular USB. So we're going to hook it up to one of the machines and we're going to do some testing on the laptop. So let's go ahead and do that. So on the microphone itself, there's a little, there's a little blue button. If you can see, I'm going to move my little microphone a little bit off here so you guys can see it. But the audio on this is just, it's on, it's, it's on spot right now. Now to turn it on and off, I had to, you know, it didn't want to pick up at first. So I had to turn it off and on and it picked up. Um, I had to mess around with it first because I was a little hesitant about, Hey, it's not working, but you need to turn it off if you're using the USB and then you turn it back on and it picks up the USB. So right now I do have the on button. If you guys can see it and it's only one cable I have on it. All right. And that's pretty much it. It's one cable. Now, I, I'm not using any of these, but if I want to listen to music, um, you don't require the battery now, so, but it tones out everything. These are actually really nice fit for my head. And I got a big head, no hair right now, but imagine if I had hair, these are actually, I didn't even stretch them. If you guys notice, I didn't even stretch them. They're just perfect fit for me. Now we're, we are going to do a couple of tests on it. And I like to do a test where I bring crowd noise in the background and see how good is it for noise cancellation. So put crowd noise. And I like to go to this one effect that it's a stadium. So we're going to go ahead and play it. All right, we're going to start the crowd noise right now. I have it on pause, but I'm going to step up and I'm going to see how much I'm going to listen to it and I'm going to talk over it. So we have the crowd noise in the background. And I can still still picking up some of the crowd noise, but if I step back or if I closer, it, it's a little loud but it is canceling some of the main effects and you're not going to be able to hear too much of it but i'm gonna let it run for a couple more minutes for a couple more seconds actually so the reason i like to run these tests if if you're doing meetings teams or zoom or any kind of uh, social media uh, video conferencing system that you're doing uh, and you want to make sure you tone out any background noise it could be your kids it could be people walking around it could be a lot of things that could be happening about your dogs barking cars running around it, it's multiple things and i like microphones that tune out that part and they listen to you so you can actually turn off the speakers off from the ps uh from the ps5 if you're using ps5 you can turn off the p you can turn them off but it still keeps on charging the, the headsets. Oh, that's pretty cool. Do you have to have them on when you're charging, you said? Yeah, you have to push, you have to click it on, to, uh, turn on the speakers in order to be charging them. You what can't, you and then it turns off, these? it turns off of itself when it's fully charged. Oh, and do they, like, if you're not using them, do they turn off too? If yeah, they're, they're yeah. Out, it better be with a rampart. The only the only thing that I don't really like really money. like, but it's it like it's one little thing. So let's say I'm, if I'm moving my headsets, automatically if I click on the side of the earpiece on the left hand side, mm -hmm. it it puts it on hold. It, it puts jump you on hold, and and you don't know that. Let's say you're not aware, and oh, you can hold you can you can you can mute you can mute yourself from people. Oh, and it doesn't tell you when it's muted, like if you can't oh, no, hear it. No, it doesn't. It doesn't. You can win. It doesn't. Okay. So right. that's why. That's the only thing. That's the only thing. But other than that, everything's great. Only fight the okay. batteries, you know. Right. You can win. Hey, uh, way better than the other headsets, Hall. Because yeah. of the, what? What didn't you like about the other ones? The cord. <laughs> the cord, man. I hate it. I hate it with guts. The cord is so long, and then it gets tangled in my feet, and like you're sitting down. And it, it's just. It was. And this is wireless. You can. This I can go. Yeah, I can actually go to the uh, right here, right here, right here, a few steps away from yep. the door, and I can still, it still be good. Oh. I was still listening to the music when I was, I was kind of far. 
good headsets. i can't i can't complain.